Okay guys, quick update for Capital Audio Fest. Again, before it even starts, I need to update what I already did. I talked about in the previous video, four new things I wanted to see based on my pre-show prep coverage. But actually, since being here last night, um, there's a bunch of other things that are really cool that I should have added to that list. And uh, first being the Lanche speakers that Oz is carrying now. Uh, high end by Oz. I did learn about this back in Seattle. I can keep a secret. He told me he was going to be carrying this brand. And is this the, it's not the first time I've heard them because eight years ago they were at Rocky Mountain and I've heard them in the past. But they're one of the few speakers that use the plasma tweeter. The acapellas are the other ones that I've featured at that million dollar audio system in my video this summer. And actually Oz tells me that acapella buys their plasma tweeters from Lanche. So this is definitely something you want to check out. They're still in the middle of setup so don't make too many conclusions based on last night's coverage I only did a very brief video on the actual sound quality because it's not fair when people are in the middle of setting up short before the show even starts but it will parlay into what I talked about I'm going to focus on in this um, show is how people dial things in so it'll be great to see by Sunday I'm sure I'm going to go back to the room several times how much different it's dialed in because uh, Oz knows what he's doing that and Greg that's going to be a great room uh, for sure so definitely something you want to check out the other super cool thing, the first person I ran into while I was here was Duke Lejeune, who was formerly with Audio Kinesis, but he told me he's with a new company that he started with Jim Romain called Lucio, and they have a new speaker that's the most, the highest price one that Duke's ever done. And I've known Duke for over 20 something years, and he, ironically, we were talking in the WhatsApp group to my members' WhatsApp group about Sound Lab speakers. He was the one of the few people that I knew owned one, and I heard him at his house many years ago when he lived in New Orleans. So anyway, fast forward, he's had other brands, more budget oriented, but high quality brands. And he's also kind of been a ringleader for this swarm method of setting up sub instead of stacking them, dispersing them in the room. And JR with Wally Tools, has come up with a proprietary setup process that is being used in that room that for Lucio speakers. And he, Duke, was extremely impressed with JR's setup. I'm always impressed with JR. He's coming down to visit me in January and uh, gonna do a seminar at 3MA in Houston and visit some other clients he has. So he's gonna bring that Swarm uh, subwoofer and we're try gonna try to do it in my home and navigate the challenges there. And that's gonna be really cool. But here's a chance for me to see it in action on another system and preview it for you guys. So stay tuned for that. The other thing I learned about is uh, from the BPI guys is that the Audio Technica has a cartridge around $9,000, which is their anniversary cartridge, and people are raving about this cartridge. And so uh, I'm definitely going to be checking that out, even though I'm not a vinyl guy. But here's what's really cool I was challenged to go in that room, believe it or not, lick my fingers, and try to stop the uh, and run my fingers on the turntable flatter while it's playing to see if it'll stop or slow down because evidently the engine, the motor is really strong. And, correcting so we'll see if they're really serious about that I'll do it on camera for you guys um, in that room so stay tuned for that I'll try to do that maybe today also there's a lot of scuttlebutt about other speakers that are totally new Charles Kiermaier I can't think of it off the top of my head told me about a room that's a, a new revolutionary speaker in many ways so again there's a lot of things that I wasn't expecting to be new at this show but I will be featuring those. Try to do many of them today. If I can't get to them all today, you know I'm gonna be here all weekend uploading stuff, stream of conscious uh, streaming, quasi streaming is what I call it anyway. So stay tuned, enjoy. Be sure to give me your feedback in the comments. I try to read it when I get a chance and respond and I'll see you back here soon.